Hello dear friends and welcome back to the abyssal world of Subnautica. It's been quite a while since I last saw you here. I hope you had a lovely uh, holiday season with Halloween, Samhain, Dia de los Muertos, or whichever holiday you happen to celebrate at that time. Um, I know I had a pretty fun time with some of my friends. Uh, my Spooktober celebrations are finished. Okay, so I need to click that. I'm playing different games lately. I forgot the controls for a second. But, um... Uh, so, my Spooktober celebrations are done. Um, I've got plenty more series planned for the future. But I figured it was about time we returned to Subnautica and wrap this guy up. Uh, last time we were here, we were exploring the Lost River where we stumbled upon a giant skeleton as well as another small research area where we got a bunch of new scans. But I believe that wraps up everything we needed to find down here. So we're going to work on getting out of here, going back to the surface, recovering our prawn suit, shutting down that cannon, and we'll probably make it home today. Let's shut off internal lights. Let's turn on external lights. That might help us navigate our way around here. Fire up that engine and let's go home. My Cyclops engines are a little low, but uh, what ifs? We'll make it. I'm pretty confident in that. So yeah, Subnautica is out. At least for uh, for us in this adventure, we're going to be coming to a close soon after we escape the planet. But that, oh, I hit something. That will not be the last you have seen of me. I do have other series for other games planned, not to mention um, the standalone expansion for this game called, um, let's get some sonar. Not, not the shield, sonar. Um, the standalone expansion for this game called Sub-Zero is actually soon to be released and after we finish up here we'll probably revisit for that DLC. Now I hope that this is the way out. I have no clue. I kinda really just hopped in here for this episode. I didn't do any exploring or researching or anything like that so I have no clue where I'm going. I think we're going the right way though. Oh yep here and we're uh, returning to the uh, giant skeleton in the Lost River, and there's the ghost leviathan. The ghost leviathan, I guess, juvenile, as it were. He doesn't like us being here. I can tell that much. But I think we can survive an attack from him. Shields up! Ah! Sucker. We are running out of power very quickly, though. I can get rid of the sonar, at least. I think we got spare power cells in the back, though. We should be okay. Now, if I remember correctly, this entrance to the Lost River, which we came in here... Oh, sea down. Let's go down. Um, yes, this entrance to the Lost River is attached to a blood kelp zone, which by themselves can be pretty creepy. I think some uh, ghost leviathan juveniles can be found in here as well. I don't think we've stumbled across one, but yeah, it's getting dark. I'm going to pause for a second. Or not pause, but, you know, stop driving for a second and go swap out some of those uh, power cells. Load that all the way up, and we should be plenty ready to go. Let's turn on interior lighting so I can get myself a drink. Ooh, marble melons. Marble melons will be good. Oh, I forgot I've got fresh water here. All right, we're solid. We're good. And let us continue. I wonder if we could go straight up from here or if there's a roof. Only when we find out. Engage sonar. Looks like we might be able to squeeze through the top here. I'm not sure. Ooh, we got close to something. Ooh, yeah, this is pretty dark down here. 
Oh boy. Oh, there's a wreckage and a warper, which is why I don't want to go visit that wreckage. <laughs> we'll forget about that for now. Have we reached? I believe we've reached the surface. Ooh, reefbacks. Haven't seen you guys in a long time. I missed you. All right, I think we're just gonna do a straight surface. Let's see if we can find out where the. Oh wait a second, I, I can just look at the beacons. Yeah, we want to we want to go find the uh, prawn suit. There it is, because if you remember last time, we parked the prawn suit near a uh, uh, near the cannon by that portal to the cannon. <laughs> kind of want to keep Sword Eye active so we can see what might be lurking out there. Oh, there's a Reaper Leviathan off to our, uh, what is that, port side? Yeah, left is port side, right? I think it is. Forgive the sniffles, I'm kind of coming off of a cold. Yeah, let's uh, go up a little bit. He's not paying attention to us, we're good. Oh, it's so nice to see the surface again. It's been a while since we were last here. Well, I guess not quite. We kind of visited for a split second when we were exploring the portals down by the uh, primary containment facility. <laughs> but it's been, the, it's the first time we've been up here in a while where we're actually gonna stay up here. You know, I guess maybe I've just lost my sense of fear of this place because we've been here for so long. It's almost become our, our home. We can't keep it that way though. This is this is not our home. It never will be our home. Home is back on wherever we came from. Did we come from Earth? I can't remember. Anyway, hello, Reefbacks. Pleasure seeing you here. Whoa! I I drifted into a pod a little bit. Gotta be careful about that. Excuse me. Out of my way. I like that horn. Oh, I think I clipped one. Excuse me. Excuse me. Let me go. What the hell? Oh, okay. We were just flipping forward for some reason. That's weird. Did we, like, break a ballast tank or something like that? Why are we leaning forward so hard? Yeah, we're we're really leaning. Why is that? It seems to be riding itself though. We're okay. So yeah, our primary objective for today was to rescue the prawn suit, shut off that cannon, go home and prepare for the building of our escape craft. Once we disable the cannon, we should be able to get out of here easy peasy. Is that another reef pack? Yeah. Hey, big guy. We are getting close. There she is. And there's a warper, but I'm not too scared of you. I wonder if we'll see the uh, little Emperor Leviathans around here. There's those enzymes they've been laying everywhere. Some of these creatures might start being cured soon, which would be awesome. All right, let's hop down and give the prawn suit a rescue. Not the upgrades, get in the prawn suit. Welcome there we go. The board, Captain.
And in we go. And now we can park the Cyclops in that moon pool. Shut down this engine for good. There it is, in fact. Whoa, did we breach? It's kind of awesome. Except now we're way leaning. Engine powering down. Whoa. <laughs> I think the physics of this are a little wonky right now. It's being weird. All right. Back on the surface. Yeah, I think the physics for riding the Cyclops are strangely wonky right now. Anyway, let's find this bloody control room and shut her down. All right, I believe here it is. All right, open sesame, bitch. I got the key, which is curedness. Oh, he got pissed. <laughs> He's like, stop moving. I punched it. Oh. Um. Oh. So that just powers down the whole freaking thing, doesn't it? That sounds creepy. Sounds like the uh, siren that it tried to give off when it shot down the sunbeam. That was definitely winding down. Why do I get the feeling that it's going to summon like a ton of enemies to just swarm me right now? Like someone did not want me shutting that down. But I did everything it that I was supposed to. I, you know, brought the cure out into the world. Here we go. Huh? And back to the surface. Why is there water in here? Um. Why is there water in my Cyclops? Engine. Do I have a leak or something? Okay, the water's gone. That was just a weird graphical thing then. Actually, let's get the backup camera. Here we go. I parked in here pretty neatly. There's that portal. <sighs> Goodbye, Emperor Leviathan. I hope we did the right thing by setting them free. I think we did, though. Now let's head home. Figure out what we're going to do next episode. You know, it's kind of sad that we're going to be leaving this world soon. It's kind of like moving away from a home that you've spent years living at. I mean, I know if you compile all of the, the gameplay that I've put into this series, it might equate to, you know, only a few, like, so many hours worth, but, you know, it's like, I guess because I spaced the episodes out over the course of, like, one a week, so it was like, I spent months here, I guess because I gave myself time to sit back and think about what I was doing, what was going on. Yeah, it's like that bittersweet thing of we're moving away from the home you know, but at least there's new adventures ahead. All I can hope for is that there will be many, many, many more adventures ahead.
I bet the fish I keep hitting won't miss me, though. <laughs> I've been giving everyone a big headache. All right, and here it is. Our home. With all our fish buddies, our gorgeous garden. Our advents of technology. Advents? Is that the word I'm looking for? I don't know. That camera is still getting a ride from uh, freaking. Um, they're not saber tooths. What are they? They're stalkers. That's it. I was right. It is an S word. <laughs> Alright, let's park the prawn suit. Step inside and see if everyone missed us. Whoa, ow. I, I did that a little too fast. Excuse me. Coming in for a park job. Welcome aboard, Captain. And perfect. Oh, and here we are. I've missed this place. I mean, I guess at one point we kind of came back here to grab a few things to make the enzymes, but... Wow, look at that. A school of boomerang doing a very strange pattern. It's kind of cool. Let's go check out the fish friends. Hello, fishy friends. Did you miss us? I hope you guys had plenty of food in here. We really haven't been here to feed you guys. I hope you haven't been eating each other. I don't think that. I don't think so, though. I think everyone's in there. Everyone's in there, all right. Oh, and where's, uh... Where's our little but garden buddy? The, uh... Our cuttlefish friend. Because I got a... I got a friend for you. Where is he? There he is! Come here, you little bastard. I want to say hi to you. Hey! Hey there! You missed us? Want a cookie? You want a cute little cookie? There you go. Want a cute little cookie? That doesn't make any fucking sense. Oh, I missed you so much. I even came to the place safe. Keeping yourself safe, I see. Well, guess what I got for you? I got you... a little friend. Yeah, I guess if I just leave that sit there, will it hatch? Or do I need to hatch it in the other... I think I need to hatch it in the other thing, actually. Let's hatch it in there. Drop the cuttlefish egg. Its eyes are kind of creepy. Oh, that! look at that! Oops! <laughs> look at that face! Oh, he's so adorable! So, so wait, the little uh, embryo in there can actually see out? That's kind of creepy. Oh, look at that little face looking around everywhere. So cute. I wish we could take them with us, but I don't think the uh, shuttle will have a. Uh, I don't think our escape shuttle will have a uh, containment center for them. All right. Now that we finally made it back to the surface, our next objective is to, I guess, find out what it takes to build both the um, the launch platform. And the shuttle itself. And for that, I guess we need to go up here. Alright. Neptune escape rocket. There's the launch platform. It needs two titanium ingots, a computer chip, and four lead? I think we already have all of that. Let's give it a look-see really quick and we'll construct that. All right, Neptune launch platform. Let's go, boys. I froze for a second. Oh, there it is. Holy moly, that's big. And splash! Woo. 
Thanks, guys. Take a rest. All right. Here's our launch platform. Oh, you've got four builder bots, too. Neptune Gantry, Plasteel Ingot, Copper Wire, and Lubricant. Okay, so it's going to make me progressively build these things. All right, well, I, that is break time for now. In the next episode, we are going to scour the land looking for, you know, missing scans we might have overlooked, maybe explore a few new wreckages, all the while gathering materials with which to build our escape rocket. But thank you so much for joining me in this latest episode of Subnautica. I hope to see you next time. Take care.